there are approximately 20,000 to 25,000 genes in the human body. Every healthy person has two copies of each gene, one inherited from our mother and one from our father. Angelman syndrome is caused by the loss of function of a single gene, UBE3A, on chromosome 15, which is vital to how the brain controls speech, movement, and learning. The UBE3A gene codes for UBE3A protein, which tags other proteins in our cells for recycling in a process called ubiquitination. In our central nervous system, only our mother's copy of the UBE3A gene is expressed or active. The copy inherited from our father is silenced by a mechanism called the antisense transcript. This is a phenomenon known as genomic imprinting, which only affects approximately 1% of our genome. In individuals with Angelman syndrome, the maternal copy of UBE3A is either missing or non-functional, while the paternal copy is present but normally silenced. Research funded by FAST has investigated multiple ways to restore functional UBE3A in the central nervous system as a potential therapeutic for those affected by Angelman syndrome. One strategy involves using an adeno-associated virus to deliver a functional UBE3A gene into neurons. Another promising strategy uses an antisense oligonucleotide to unsilence the paternal copy of the UBE3A. These research strategies and others have demonstrated very positive outcomes in animal models of Angelman syndrome. At least one of these strategies is expected to be in human clinical trial in 2020 as we march ever closer to curing Angelman syndrome.